Paragold firefighters are just several weeks away from moving into their new fire station as it's in its final stages of completion. Chief Kevin Lang tells me that this will benefit the whole town. Everybody's very excited about it. I mean, it's just, you know, it's a new facility. It's a bigger facility. Uh, it's going to be easier for us to operate out of with the drive through bays. Uh, just more space, you know, more space to work out of. There's several upgrades that, that we don't have at this particular station. Of course, this one was built in the 40s. They are a little over one month away from moving. The new fire station will offer many features like a storm shelter and training room that can accommodate 70 people before social distancing. That will be used for meetings and community classes like CPR and first aid. Chief Lang details a few more features of the new station. It has a gym facility in it that's available to all city employees to be able to use at any time. Guys will have a great room that have a kitchen living space in it. We'll have individual sleeping rooms in it. Drive through bays for the trucks, a huge upgrade for us. That's a big safety factor to be able to drive through the bays instead of trying to back the truck in and connect to it. Construction began in August 2019 on the $4.7 million building that sits on Highway 49 North in town. The station can sleep six at once, the same number of firefighters that are on duty at a time. The building will also have five bays, one for each fire engine. Chief Lang says the new location will cut down on response times. Better coverage and quicker response to the northern parts of the city. We're not moving that far from where our current location is. The way will be set up on the highway. We'll have a lot quicker access to the northern industrial park and some of the northern areas of town that's, that's seeing some residential growth as well. Now in the future, the department hopes to build additional training facilities, including a tower. Now Chief Lang says that this building is expected to serve the town for the next 60 to 70 years. For Northeast Arkansas News, I am Sarah Doan in Paragold.